It took 5,127 prototypes and 14 years to create the Dyson Dual Cyclone. It's the 70s and James Dyson is about to leave his dream job to do something you and I have always wanted to do, invent a new wheelbarrow. Retailers reject it, so it goes direct to consumer, grows the business, and gets kicked out by the board with a patent under the company's name. But while working there, Dyson thought that he could design a better vacuum without a bag. So in 79, he goes into three years of prototyping, and after two years of sales, he signs a licensing agreement with Amway. They cancel it, copy his design, and sue him. By 92, they settle, and Dyson now has a product he produced and owned, but with no distribution. Just like Yvonne Chouinard of Patagonia, Dyson knew people will always pay for quality if you educate them. See, the problem wasn't the vacuum, but the bag itself. In 93, Dyson goes D to C with the Say Goodbye to the Bag ad campaign to teach customers the true problem was the bag. Despite costing twice as much, the Dual Cyclone was the fastest selling vacuum in the UK. That's why, 